Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, another map review for you today, um, and uh, I wanted to do Laser Tag 2, but I feel like we should start with the first Laser Tag map first. Um, so, um, I don't actually don't know how much this did cost, because I bought it a while ago. Um, if I can see... Um... I have absolutely no idea how much it cost, but I know it was not that much. Um, and when you spawn in, you're just spawning like right here, and you will be facing this. So shortcuts, um, uh, ground ally basement access, and uh, and best basically. I, I I kind of forget what these do, but I'm pretty sure yeah. So ground alley. So okay. Shortcuts are basically extra parts of the map. Um, so basement access, that's a whole basement part of uh, Ground Alley. And Sky Canyon has a giant bridge um, that you can go across. Uh, you can also select the map, which is either Sky Canyon or Ground Alley. Um, it's either 15 points or 25 points. I'm going to do 25 for now. We're going to go with Sky Canyon. And... You are not locked in when you press um, a button. So we're going to go Sky Canyon first. Uh, we're going to go Shortcuts Off first. Um, and when we press Start, um, you'll see the score pop up on the side. And this is how you pick teams. So I'm going to pick a red team. And I spawn in, and as soon as I do this, boom, I get my stuff. Um, for the sake of this video, I'm going to go in game mode C and do slash clear at A and now I have a full clear inventory. So the map itself with no um, laser bridge or whatever um, have a lot of access to different areas and I forget what the um, laser bridge was like um, we'll check that in a second but basically um, I think it was actually like right here. I think it was just, yeah. Um, so as of right now, just from the map itself, like how it looks, it's not bad. Um, I like the look of it. I think it looks pretty cool. You cannot go on that top part, I don't think. Um, but you can go through these portals. And this is what happens. I don't think it was actually the map. I, it's just, for some reason, Bedrock thinks it's funny. Oh. Let's do at A, zero, two hundred, zero. Okay. Let's find where we were over here. Um, so that's the other map. We'll talk about that one. Um, we'll talk about this with the laser bridge or whatever it's called on. But um, if we can grab, where were the... There you go. Uh, there isn't really many barriers. Um, as you can see, and if you wanted to actually, you could probably, I don't know, if you have, there's no way to get fires, it's not a thing, but, um, yeah, this nice little bridge area, um, a little bit of parkour involved, uh, not much though, and if we go down, and both of these bases are exactly the same, it's basically just a mirror, um, and there's a downstairs area, and this is really cool. It's not really the most useful thing ever, but you can shoot here. So I guess if you you would have to time this very closely, but you could shoot someone if they're come through there, or over here, which I guess you could. This is much better. Um, that was actually when we played. It was a very good angle. They get on the enemy team. Um, they spawn. It looks like it's another portal. And going through here, it's just nothing. I don't actually know why that's there. Um, that may have actually been the way to go um, through the, the bridge or whatever. So let's go ahead and actually uh, reset, which I think is over here. So 
me uh, break through this. This is the lapis. Blue wool. Wow, interesting. Uh, let me put this back. What? Where did I break? I broke that out of all things. Um, let's go back to map select. Let's go ahead and reset and let's put shortcuts on. Go Sky Canyon. And let's see the difference. It's not much of a difference, but it is a shortcut. Um, let me actually check. Was that? Yeah, I don't know why this is here. This is just a cool place to stay, I guess. Um, so there's about like three ways you can go through, and as you can see, it's just helping you through this section. Um, so yeah, let's go back to map select really quick. Actually, this is the map select, I think. I didn't actually know this was right here. Uh, let's go in through the top. And let's go ahead and reset. And let's go to shortcuts off, ground alley. And start. Let's go ahead and... Go ahead and clear really quick. Whoops. Same deal here. I don't know what this room is supposed to be. You have a. What is this? Oh, yeah, that's um. What is this? This is the basement. Did that again. That doesn't happen. I don't think that actually happens when you're in survival. It just happens when you're like... Alright, that's weird. Let's fly back down here. Um, so yeah. Um, it's a I, I kind of like this map a little bit better. Um, both of them are pretty equal though. Um, the starting point here is very similar on both. But, let's actually go back. This is a cool thing that I like. You can actually go up here and you have this top part you can go through there but you can also come over here and this doesn't really lead to anywhere it's just a sniping perch um... so yeah you can snipe people I guess um... it's not a bad uh, arena let me actually see, I wanna see um... I, I don't know if we had shortcuts on or not, but that was access to the basement. Which I don't think you're supposed to have access to the basement. Maybe you are, I don't know, maybe this is, there's more to this, I can't forget. Um, but yeah, you have, you can just go through this way. I, I do like that, I think this is a better map as far as um, large player counts go, because there's a lot more uh, flanking areas. I mean, it's not bad for 1v1s and stuff. And especially, it, it's good for when... What is this? I don't know. Um, for when you have people who like to, you know, start flanking and stuff. And Honestly, it's not bad. I do like the map. I think this is actually one of the better maps that I've seen. And, um... If we go back, I want to see if we had shortcuts on. Let's put that back. Uh, reset. Get them off. Let's reset. Let's go off and then press ground alley and then start. Let's see if that changes anything. Because I, I think I started it before I changed it or something. You're not? I don't know. Oh yeah, I can't go back in. Um, let's go through it this way. Um, I, I'm just going in creative and stuff because I feel like it you know, I can show you guys the map a little bit better. 
Let's reset. Let's put short uh, shortcuts on and go see what the difference is. I really kind of forget, to be honest. So, supposed to be a basement, which I think this is the basement, but maybe it's bugged or something, I don't know. I don't know, there's no real difference. I don't know what those, those portals are supposed to lead, I think, to the top section. Now we're back at this map. But yeah, um... Honestly, the portal thing, I don't know what's up with that. That's just a a um, bedrock problem. It's not this map. I think it might be because I'm in creative. Um, but overall, as like a, a nice map to just kind of play around with, it's not bad. Um, I'm going to say this, though. If you can... if If... I don't know if it's a different price or whatever, but if um, if you can get laser tag too, um, it's much better. Uh, this I, I'd say this is actually slightly better for like one v oneing, but if you're not one v oneing, and even if you are one v oneing, I'd still recommend laser tag too. You get more map variety. Um, you get I I'd say better. Um, quality to life changes um I, I think the maps are really the only thing that changed that was massive um the the um there's like five maps and five is better than two um and the maps in this are very similar like i i like there's some memorable ones like the uh, shipment esque one there's the bricks there's the uh, temple and this one you just have like they're basically uh, identical, but I, I'd still say it's a better map than most others on the uh, store. It, it's definitely taking a, a nice, simple approach. I don't know why it teleported me back. Um, I don't know, Sky Canyon, I, I do like compared to the other one. I, I don't know if it's better, but it's definitely more streamlined simple compared to the uh it's more simple compared to the um the other one and i, I kind of like that better i just kind of like that it's it's not crazy it's not doing anything nuts um but yeah honestly I, I i like this map it's pretty fun um i don't think it's that much either so yeah if you just want a cool pvp map to mess around with um i'd say the essential pvp one that i reviewed um earlier um is probably better for like people who i don't know how do i put this for people that really um they really like the uh the aspect of a survival games map compared to this which is like I don't know what you'd really call it, just a a deathmatch? I don't know. Um, I, I don't know what you'd call it. Um, a laser tag, I guess. Um, so, yeah. Uh, if, if you guys want to see more of these, that I definitely do them. Oh yeah, uh, by the way, you get custom, um, some custom stuff. Um, you get these two, and the stair variants and stuff, and all the blocks. I don't know what the blocks actually are. Cobblestone and mossy cobblestone. And then you get the uh, the golden iron helmets. And then you get diamond swords, which are these, and then you wore bows. Um, so really, they didn't do much. What else? I don't know. I think they may have... There's definitely other stuff that I'm probably missing, but... This isn't much of a texture... Like a texture pack change. It's just a cool PvP map. Um, 
And you do have healing potions, which are instant health, uh, and ammo. And it does have sound effects. Um, the diamond sword is just like a green... It's like a lightsaber, I guess, I don't know. Um, and yeah, by the way, it does not clear your glass bottle, which are... And it's not gonna make or break the game, I'm just saying it could be changed. Um, and by the way, I know this is gonna... It, it's... It, it goes without showing that if you want to, you can buy this and then uh, go ahead and change the maps up. Like if I wanted a... Um, a slightly bigger area here. Or you could honestly change the map completely. It doesn't need to be anything like how it is now. Um, you could do that, you could maybe make, um, select that or something. I don't know, you can do really whatever you want. Um, if I, if I would do something, I, I my, I, I definitely change that map or this map or something to make it a little bit more different. Um, but yeah, there's some unique things about this. I like how it's not dependent on making that look incredible. I like how it has portals that it's kind of like, uh, you know, that's different. And the uh, the whole shortcut aspect is definitely a weird one. But um, yeah, that's the uh, laser tag map. I don't know. I, I don't know exactly who it's made by. I think it was, um, I completely forget. Uh, but yeah, it is laser tag. Just look up laser in the uh, shop, and this is Bedrock only, by the way. So, yeah. Um, thank you guys for watching. Oh yeah, also, I don't know if this is, um, if you want to change this, but if you do get the map, do, um, slash game rule, um, do daylight cycle, pulse, that way it stays day. And then I should probably actually change the time to noon. There we go. So, uh, yeah. That's about it, guys. Um, if you want to see more of these, let me know. I'm. Uh, this is just a really... Uh, I know this is kind of a boring episode, because, like... I, I, I really have not, no, nothing much to say about it. Um, it's just... A cool world I guess I don't know I mean there's not really much to it there's two maps you have you spawn in with items it's not like um like the other one that we just reviewed the uh pvp essentials because it's and it's two very similar maps very simple gameplay there's not much to really talk about but I would say it's solid it's definitely simple and I like that you know so uh, thank you guys for watching I'll see you guys next time peace out